I want you to make this worse because somebody is having sleepless nights because they are thinking something about you. And by the way, I'm Ishmael and your priest and I welcome you to today's video. Now, listen, I like the fact that the Bible did make it clear that when it comes to Mordecai, he could not sleep and he opened the, the, the books of history. And then that's when he saw that Mordecai once helped him in the past. And he asked what was given to such a man and were like nothing. And that's when the man was like, no, something good was supposed to have done. This man played a huge role. So now, you know, like guilt made Judas Iscariot to self-destruct. Jesus did not do anything, but it was making him restless. I have betrayed, I have sinned, I have betrayed the son of God. Better I just die, I don't deserve to leave. Let me tell you, there are people who are going to hurt you. Your silence will speak for you. God will fight for you. It is true when people say, God will fight my battles. It's just that some people, they exaggerate to an extent where sometimes even if God gives them an instruction to do something, to speak the name of Jesus and so that other thing goes away, they always now put the fight to God to an extent where now it's almost like God is living for them when they have stopped living. So you must learn to understand when God says, don't do anything. Even in the Bible, there were some battles who would say, do nothing, don't move, I will fight for you. Like literally so. You get what I'm saying? So that's it. There are those that have robbed you in the past. Sometimes you wonder why somebody out of the blue, they just give you money. They do something nice. They know what they have done in the past. They are feeling guilty. Therefore, anything that is of you that you've been robbed of, any person who has hurt you and it feels like they got away with it, it will haunt them. I decree and I declare sleepless nights. Anything that was taken away from you, whether it is your finances, your job, your career, your joy, restoration, sleepless nights, let them return what belongs to you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. My details on the comment section below. See you next time.